Well, after 17 months, the uh, the eight cell stock nickel metal battery in my 9303 decided to die. Uh, three of the cells are shot; they won't take a charge. And when you're charging it up, you can watch the voltage shoot up to like 15, 16 volts on the charger, and uh, it only holds a couple hundred milliamps. It would get hot almost instantly. So. Uh, being in a bind and wanting to fly and not having another battery to stick in it and not wanting to go get one right now and knowing of the dangers of putting a LiPo in a 9303 or any other spectrum transmitter I got to doing some research and came up with this simple answer uh, that others have implemented and I'm just copying and um, that implementation is you take a three cell LiPo and you put two diodes in it. I've got a, a uh, connector, a female connector I robbed off of an old charger off the balance port and I've got two diodes that I soldered to the wire connectors there and then took the stock pigtail off the battery and soldered to the other end of the diodes and um, they'll only go in one way if you put them in wrong it won't work but each diode drops seven tenths of a volt so the two diodes together knock off 1.4 volts total off the battery uh, end result, a fully charged battery at 12.6 uh, shows up on the transmitter at 11.2 and uh, then it fairly quickly drops down into the 10 volt range and hangs out around 10. Um, I had it after three hours of run, it was at like 9.5 and um, that was, uh, I put 450 milliamps back in it after three hours so it pulls about 150 milliamps an hour so I've got this little 500 cell in there right now because uh, that's just what I had laying around that I'm not using and um, I'll get three hours out of that when I get time since I'm going into the balance port I can just uh, put any size lipo that I can find in there my other ones that I'm using for my uh, 450 pack they're too big to fit in the back of the transmitter so uh, I work with what I got and um, I think this will be alright for a bit here so this is fully charged I just took it off the charger after balancing it again and um, here's what we get when we uh, kick it on 11.1 uh, .1. it fluctuates 11.1, 11.2 after the three hour run it was nothing was warm everything was nice and even tamped and life is good so there we go the LiPo powered 9303 with two diodes in series to drop the voltage down to a safe region that's it